Hi, I'm Dr. Pam Lacey, an OBGYN on staff at Baptist Memorial Hospital Golden Triangle, and tonight I'll be talking with you about endometrial cancer. Endometrial cancer occurs in the lining of the uterus. It is the most common female cancer in the United States. Endometrial cancer occurs when the cells of the endometrium begin to grow too rapidly. Risk factors for endometrial cancer include age, with most cases being diagnosed in postmenopausal women in their mid-60s, being overweight with a BMI of 25 or greater, any condition that causes an increase in the estrogen levels in the body, such as polycystic ovarian syndrome, and certain genetic mutations. The most common sign of endometrial cancer is abnormal uterine bleeding. Any postmenopausal bleeding is considered abnormal and should be evaluated by a physician right away. Postmenopausal bleeding should be evaluated by transvaginal ultrasound to look for a thickened endometrium. An endometrial biopsy is also performed to aid with diagnosis. Endometrial cancer is treated with surgery, chemotherapy, and or radiation. Surgical treatment and staging can include removing the uterus, cervix, ovaries, and fallopian tubes. The stage of the cancer determines if chemotherapy or radiation is needed after surgery. Patients diagnosed with endometrial cancer should be evaluated and treated by a GYN oncologist, a doctor specially trained in evaluation and management of female cancers. Join us next time for Health Talk with Baptist, where we'll be discussing ovarian cancer. Mail your topic suggestions to Health Talk at WCBI.com. Health Talk has been brought to you by Baptist Memorial Hospital Golden Triangle.